Did the Houston Texans make a mistake with Stephon Diggs? What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to a brand new episode of The Lead. Your host, as always, Harley Dugan. What am I talking about in the intro? I am talking about the latest right now coming from Adam Schefter. It is going to detail the contracts with Stephon Diggs and the Houston Texans. And I don't know if I'm a big fan of this. I don't know if I'm a big fan of what Nick Casario and the Houston Texans just did with Stephon Diggs. I know yesterday was completely different. We traded for him. We got ourselves an elite wide receiver, top 10, and you're appearing with Nico Collins and Tank Dell. But the latest from Adam Schefter is, we got it right here, Buffalo-Houston trade. The Houston Texans wiped out the final three years on Diggs' contract. That gives him the ability to become a free agent after this season. League sources tell ESPN the Texans also took the $3.5 million guaranteed next season and moved it to this season, giving him a raise assuring of $22.5 million in guaranteed money. I am not the biggest fan of this. The Houston Texans have now voided the three years that were left on the contract for Stephon Diggs and are now going to have him for a one-year deal. They are having him for a rental year. I'm not the biggest fan of this, mostly because at the end of the day, Diggs, I thought initially, was going to be here for possibly four years. This year, three more. I don't have a problem with it. Not paying him too much money either. Cool. Paired him. You could still pay a Nico Collins. You have Tank Dell. No problem. I liked it. Now I'm a little bit sure. I still like Stephon Diggs and I'm expecting big things this year, but I'm just a little bit bothered by the idea of now If you want to keep Stephon Diggs going into the next year, you have to give him an extension. And that is just something I am not liking for the Texans just because you are now going to pay him more money when you really necessarily didn't have to. There had to been something behind the closed doors, which we don't really know. At the end of the day, you're also, and we can take a look at this on the other end of the perspective here, is You're getting a guy on a one-year deal that has to prove to himself and to the rest of the NFL, do you want that big-time money? Then you got to go out there and ball. And that is something that Stephon Diggs could absolutely do. There's nothing wrong with that either. But I do expect him to ball regardless just because you have C.J. Stroud, this offense, Nico Tank, Joe Mixon, Dalton Schultz, continuity, good offensive line. This offense should ball regardless. And now I'm starting to dislike this latest news from the Houston Texans on the idea of now maybe losing Stephon Diggs and only having him for one year compared to the next three. I'm not the biggest fan of it. What are your thoughts? Make sure to drop them down below in the comment section. As always, guys, go Astros, go Rockets, go Texans. You have a blessed day.